28 July 1942. Arepitimu mitera. I am well, and I hope the same for you. I am here 11 days, and up to now, the things are well. It is very hot, but at night, the weather turns and cools a lot, and I sleep really well. I found two Greek boys from Chicago. One is from the south side. I received the things, but the cookies went bad. And Salutations to all. I kiss you, your son John, Polafilia. These are some of the items that we collect and cherish. Our legacy isn't just in the history books we read. Our thread in the American flag is one to look at with admiration. We weave our culture, our traditions, and ourselves into it. It is our duty to preserve these artifacts, the culture, and the stories. From the outside perspective, it's a room of things, you know, and, and every little thing, whatever it is, it's got a story. It's a powerful thing when people see things that, you know, their family has made or their family has brought over or their family has donated to the museum. It's my grandfather's Fustanella and the thing that he felt most proud of was that. So he called my brother in on his deathbed and he said, I leave this to you. It's the only thing that has any value that I can leave you. And we have brought that with us and it grounds us. It wasn't the wealth or the quantity, it was the quality of what they brought over. It's not only keeping artifacts, that's one part of the mission, but the other part of the mission is documentation of our heritage and the contribution of Greek Americans to our society here and to the world. Everything we have, basically, you can owe to early Hellenism. Music, the arts, theater, science, math. American culture is really living the essence of what Greek democracy and adeti and personal responsibility. When I think of the Hellenic Museum, I say finally. We have all these other cultures with different centers and museums, and we waited so long for this to be built, and it's beautiful, and it's right in Greek town where it should be. I've been in this neighborhood my entire life, but just even seeing some of the pictures of a house street from 40s and 50s, you know, really piqued my interest. I am a direct descendant of this. I do what they do just later on. It's extremely important that, that our heritage and our history is here now, finally. It's a beacon. It's a voice that will go on after I'm gone.